Hello, hello, Hero Collectors here. How's it going, everybody? Hope y'all are doing fantastic. I know I am. And we're just going to do a quick video this time. We're going to talk about the two brand new reveals at Luca Comic Con, thanks to Dwight Stahl. Uh, he did reveal that we will be getting more MCU repacks that are available throughout the year, like the Spider-Man and Iron Man. This time it's a Spider-Man and Gap. I'm not going to really talk about those. They don't really interest me. But what does interest me is the new Fabian Cortez and Dark Spot from Spider-Verse. I'm a little familiar with Fabian Cortez just because of X-Men the Animated Series. And I always hear the Magneto from that series say his name, the Cortez type of thing. I don't know if that's exactly one-to-one -one how he said it. But in my head, that sounded right. But he looks pretty good. Looks... I want to say it's a modified Vulcan body, but I'm not 100% on that. But he looks pretty good. I am only familiar with a handful of Acolytes, and to be getting some new ones for the X-Men villains is good. I hope to see an Exodus at some point, and a few others. And yeah, well, I'll wait to see what all he comes with, so I'm excited there. It's not my most wanted X-Men villain, in all honesty, but still a good release. I think a lot of fans were wanting him. And then for the dark spot, I mean, this is a pretty obvious repaint. I was expecting to get this at some point and I'm glad they're doing it now because I do plan to get it. He looks to be on a translucent kind of black plastic. So you can kind of see the inner workings of the torso and see through it, which I think is pretty cool. Initially, I thought it was kind of lacking some more white spirals or just more white detailing. But apparently it's not like I went and looked at some reference from the movie and no, it's it's pretty accurate. I guess in my in my head, he had more white circles on his body, but nope, I was wrong. So very excited to see these two. I don't think there are any real details as to when they will be released. So add them to Dark Miss Marvel with the reveals, but we don't know in what capacity we are getting them. So I don't know if I'll be pre-ordering these two. It all depends on how they're packed and whatnot, but it should be good figures. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Make sure you like, subscribe, and I will talk to you all in another video, another post, another time.